You know, a lot of folks in my lifetime always had something to say about me. You know, they were always talking about me, you're weird, you know, you a player and all of those stuff, but they never really got to know me. You know, a lot of people always wanted to always talk bad about me knowing not who I really am. And you know, the ugly truth is, you know, it used to bother me. It really, it really did, but the ugly truth is y'all were too insecure. The ones that did all me, they were too insecure and too misguided and too misunderstood to really know who I really was. And so I am a person, you know, I'm a very smart person and I do whatever God leads me to do now. You know, you know, I had that low self-esteem issues, I had all of that. But it seems like now we are living in a world to where we are praising strippers, we are praising prostitutes, we are giving them all the, the, the credit. And look, I pray for everybody, don't get me wrong. But it seems like we are worshiping the songs that we hear on the radio, we keep listening to portrayal, we keep listening to lies, we keep listening to uh, sadness, you know, and then we have people that kill themselves and then all we do is just record the video instead of trying to help save their life. You know, we have people that will praise women and call them the B word, they want to call them hoes and all that other bull crap. You know, that's the ugly truth. We are living in an age to where we want to just do wrong and never do right. You know, but we, instead of us being a symbol, instead of us being a symbol of who we can be, instead of being a symbol of God, we are really just letting the devil win in our lives. And the more we let the devil win in our lives, the more things are gonna go wrong for us. Everything may feel good, everything may uh, seem good, you know, but it's only temporary, you know. Everything that the devil does is always temporary because the real thing he is trying to do is to seek, kill, and destroy you. He's always there to try to destroy you. He wants to bring you down. He does not want you to succeed. He'll probably give you a small token of goodness, but then lead you down a lifetime of destruction. But you cannot allow that to happen. And the ugly truth is, y'all do allow it to happen. You allow it to happen because you think that God is not really there for you and then you're not really being in the word now and that's what's messing you up now. You know, we have to get back in the word. The ugly truth is the devil is messing up our minds. You know, the ugly truth is we rather smash a girl than have a relationship with him. We'd rather just use a guy instead of having a good relationship with them. You know, we always pass up on God's blessings and we up there just focus on who we can play first. Say, yeah, I'm finna go play, I'm finna go play this girl first. I'm finna go play this guy first. You know, I'm just gonna scheme. You know, I'm just gonna go and plan it out to where I can mess up their life. And that's not the route to go. That's not the route that you need to go. You know, you need to get yourself together because the other truth is you are falling short of God's glory and you really are you are falling short to God to God approval because I'm telling you God is not pleased with you if you do what God asks you to do if you put in the work and you have faith and you just keep pushing and you try to live to be a better person then I guarantee you good things are going to happen in your life you are not supposed to love this world anyway that's the other truth you're not supposed to love this world you're not supposed to be here you're not supposed to be here because <clears throat> you are not conformed to the way of this world. So don't try to act like you love this world because you really shouldn't. You can love the people in it, but you cannot love this world because it gets more dangerous every day. It's still more wrong every single day. So you need to understand that the other truth is you are letting the devil in. You are letting the devil win in your life. You are letting the devil destroy you. You are letting the devil speak. For your destruction because you don't because you think there's nothing better when you are worshiping God but that is not the case you know and then the folks that want to talk about people 
you know the ugly truth is y'all got something going on in y'all life and y'all just want to put your problems out on somebody else and so you want to tease them you want to make them feel bad to let to to have them to where they want to feel terrible because you don't feel right yourself for the ones that want to talk about you every single time about this whole stupid stuff like oh well he's talking to a lot of girls okay if he's a single guy okay what are you supposed to do if he's not if he's not gay he's gonna talk to some girls i mean you gotta go through an experience in order to find that right person so if you're gonna talk to a girl go ahead ain't nobody telling you not to talk to nobody so what's that your business anyway you want them to like you because he probably don't even like messy people anyway so why even try to be messy to begin with so you need to change your way of perspective talking about trying to talk about people you need to get yourself right first before you want to bring somebody else down you're supposed to lift people up and I keep saying this all the time. The other truth is we do not lift people up. So, you want to know the real truth? Start reading the Bible more because the world getting more dangerous every single day. So, it's going to be more dangerous every day. So, that's why you got to stay prayed up and stay in the word more and just understand that God is going to make ways for you. You just got to put your trust in Him. And that's all you have to do. So, that's just how I feel about it. You know, the other truth is we are pretty much staring each other down. We are not, we don't have more love. We have more hate now in the world than we ever had before. So pretty much all I have to say about this video is, you know, stay in the word more, trust in God more, and live your life in a positive way. Stop trying to steer people down. Because the other truth is you're not right yourself, so get yourself right before you want to start to mess with other people. I'm out.